Hello everybody, welcome back to Phantom Forces. We're not playing regular Phantom Forces today, we're playing the community test environment, which... Well, in this, in this build, morally, there's, of course, a new map, which is called Airport, which I think we've seen... Uh, I think some people have seen a little bit about. I have a crane melee weapon, I have an AK-15 in my hand instead of an AK-12, I think it's the AK-15, and I have a Deagle 50 in my hand which can one shot to the head, does like 62 damage to the maximum. Um, there's a lot of changes currently in the community test environment, along with hearing other people's footsteps, I think, more frequently than you would in the past. Oh, getting headshotted in the head. <laughs> um, you can hear people's footsteps. There's new footstep sounds that do aiming sounds that do leveling up sounds. There's all these new stuff, as you can see. This is all they give you in the test environment. They give you all these weapons, and uh, they don't give you any attachments. So I don't think there's anything new at for attachment-wise as of right now. At least not that I can see. I'm really low level, so I barely have anything unlocked. You can see AK-15. That's a new weapon. The AG-3 is in here. Um, along with... What other weapons? They, oh, yeah. This is an MP5A4 is new. The Deagle 50 right here is new compared to the Deagle 44. Uh, the M60 is in here. And the BFG is in here, which is what I've noticed. There, yeah, yeah, there's crane melee, got all the machete and stuff. There's no equipment yet. The grenades have a very, very cool sound. I wish we could just throw that over there. Oh, man. What if they... Boop. Okay. Yeah, but grenades sound really cool when they blow up now. And just, along with everything else, I it just... It's, this, this update's really cool. I haven't really seen anyone lag, per se. Like, like literally, like, their character models started across my screen... So that, that'll be good if that is true. I mean, if they did fix that in a way. But I have no proof of that right now. Because I, have, I haven't I have seen anybody yet. And there's not very many people playing the test environment. Which, I'll probably put a link in the description so that you guys can play it for yourself. Because it, it really is something you should play and, and feel for yourself. Because there's new gun sounds. New gun, um, was it balance? And all this other jazz that, of course, the map and stuff. Which I'm trying to take a look at right now. I think we already have this. I, at first when I saw this this map, I thought of um, I thought of Modern Warfare 2's airport, like when I was out there. But then I came inside and noticed it was a lot different. If it was the same, like kind of sort of the same, I wouldn't mind that. But I mean it still is really cool is what they're doing. You can see there's stuff everywhere. Obviously there's some things that are just empty right now, like for instance, I just played on Crane Site, like, you know, the normal Crane Site. There's a bunch of differences and changes on that map, which is really, really cool. Which you, Like I said, go in the link in the description and play it for yourself if you haven't already, because this is really cool. Um, this was brought to my attention by Major literally, like, half an hour ago, maybe. And he told me, oh, you should check this out sometime, and I instantly went to it. And, and apparently they update it frequently, which is why game servers kind of shut down sometimes, which, you know, is perfectly fine. That, that's that's good that they update it all the time. They should really, like, implement this into the real game, like, soon. Because I think this is awesome. And that, that like, I don't know. There's a bunch of stuff changed. Boom! Okay, there's a, there's her lagging. Let's see if he pops out. Oh, he didn't. Dang it. Oh, there's little leg up noises and all this. Yeah, but see, if you, as you can see, I just two-shot. Oh, I just headshotted people with the deagle. What do I unlock these? Eh, it's a long time for those, but... Yeah, I just had one shot headshot of people that, that the Deagle 50. I don't know if the Deagle 44 will one shot. I haven't tested that, but I know that for the fact that the Deagle 50 does one shot to the head. At least at closer ranges for when you have that maximum damage so high. Which is good to know. Very, very good to know. But yeah, for now, I mean, uh, that's really all I know about the intestine environments. That they got new sounds, new looks for some things, uh, new weapons, new maps, new everything, pretty much. Like, not like really. They got. Uh, they also have new new skin cases, which is something that I know some people might want to look at. Triple kill. I'm really liking this AK-15 though. Yeah, maybe when I die here, I'll take a look at the new skins, or at least the new skin cases, and you guys can just pause the video if you want to look at them for any longer. Yeah, but we'll just play for the majority of this map, so you guys can uh, witness the new stuff. Ooh, man, that Famasa got a new sound. I heard that. 
I think, I think, um, you know, grenades got new sounds. I think you can also hear people's weapons more frequently than you could in the past, which is something that's very, very good. I, I like to, you know, know where people are so I can use sound to my advantage, but sometimes really loud in this game, but we'll, we'll see how much sound will really influence my, I, I use sound like in games like Rainbow Six Siege very heavily. So if it's going to be anything like, like, you know, better sound, it should help quite a bit. Oh, god dang it. <laughs> okay, yeah. Here, let's let's take a look at the skins. Like, you know, we got a we got another we got a new starter case with different with newer colors. As you can see, there's pretty much a lot of new colors, different shades maybe. Um, we got a wood case which is just literally gives you all kinds of wood that you can unlock for a skin camo. I don't yeah, I mean, I guess people want that. There's a technically incorrect case which I'm not mistaken is another YouTuber that they've posted videos of before. Yeah, it looks like he's got quite a few skins. Air 404. Oh, uh, there's the DR case, which I don't even know about this one. Like, this has all kinds of stuff in it. I, I actually like some skins in this. It looks pretty cool. And then, from what I know, those are the only new cases. So that that's the only that's the only new for we weapon skins. But I mean, those are pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie, those are wow. That was loud. Those are uh, those are pretty cool. Yeah, here let's blow up a grenade like right here. I just like listen to it. Oh, mine didn't make any noise. Of course it didn't. Really? When I want to hear the grenade sound, it's not going to make any noise? There's there. I think they have multiple different grenade sounds because some. So, um, if any of you played Star Wars Battlefront and seen anything about it, the grenade, like the thermal imploder, that's what some of the grenades sound like at a distance sometimes. I think is really, really cool. Yeah, there's definitely many, many different grenade sounds. Oh, I hate the Z point, but there's no doubt about that. That there's there's a whole bunch of different sounds for stuff, and even I, that's cool. They have multiple grenade sounds. Because originally grenades, you know, were just they were just there. Like a lot of the stuff that I've wanted them to change, it seems like they are changing, which is really good to see. And I like glad they're adding new weapons to try out, new weapons I'll have to master. Which I just hope this update is coming very soon. I mean, it looks like they've done a lot of work on it. Which is very, very good to see. And it looks like there's, they're listening to some people, at least. Like, they're not making the Deagle 44 head, one-shot headshot, at least, um, unless they are. But they are making, um, you know, they're making a new Deagle that pow that's more powerful, but, like, like less stats. One shot to the head, which is great. Oh, God. And it looks like everybody's falling through the world. All right, but that was a really cool look at that map. Looks like we're on Maul next. I wonder if they changed that map, too. Oh, wait, wow, hold on. It, it started right away. I want to see this. I wonder if they changed anything on here. Um, we're just going to take a quick look at this map. I just want to see if they changed anything. Because obviously they changed crane sight. Um, uh, it doesn't really look like it. Yeah, it doesn't really look like they changed much of anything on here. So, I think we'll do like one life and then we'll end it there. I got to increase my aim sensitivity. You know, I thought the Deagle 50 was going to be full auto, but it's not. What the heck is wrong with my freaking sensitivity? Hey, that was weird. God, there was something really wrong with my sensitivity there. I don't know what was going on. Like, my mouse just started to freak out. Alright, but yeah, that, that's pretty much, you know, what I wanted to show you guys in this, in this like, little build here. This is really cool. Really cool to look at, really cool they're changing a bunch of stuff, really cool they're adding a bunch of stuff, and blah, blah, blah. So, uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like down below if you guys enjoyed. Leave a comment about the test environment, which you think they should add slash change. And dislike the video if you didn't like it, because my feelings now be hurt. So, thank you guys so much for watching, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye! <laughs>